The island of Kikaijima lies in the south of Kagoshima Prefecture, in the far southwest of Japan. It's a small island with a circumference of just 50 kilometers. The land is entirely composed of coral reef. Ananda Jacobs is a U.S. actress and musician based in Japan. Here I am in Kikaijima. So I'm actually standing on something that was crafted by tiny organisms. And I'm excited to see what I can find on this island. Ah, yeah. Few tourists visit Kikaijima, and it remains quite unspoiled. People here live side by side with the beautiful wildlife. This balmy climate produces lots of great things to eat. Mm. And you just crunch the seeds, eat it all. Mm. On this edition of Journeys in Japan, Kikaijima, a subtropical paradise far from Tokyo. Kikaijima lies about 1,300 kilometers from Tokyo. The best way to get there is by plane. There are no direct flights from Tokyo, so in all, it takes about five hours to get there. Uh, the coral reef that formed Kikaijima is thought to have pushed up above sea level more than 100,000 years ago. Even now, the island is still rising about two millimeters a year. A short walk from the beach brings Ananda to a village. The roads here are lined with walls made from blackened coral. Konnichiwa. <laughs> this old lady was born and raised in Kikaijima. Strong walls are essential here because the island is often hit by typhoons. Coral is both durable and widely available. What's she doing there? Look at that. Such a lush little fella. Going right on this coral. There's another little one. That's amazing. The calcium in the coral also provides nutrients for plants. The wall acts a bit like a natural planter. Aww. This is the cutest post office I've ever seen. Ananda has heard there's someone on Kikaijima who acts as a guide. She was told to go to the local post office. Ah, konnichiwa. Konnichiwa.すみません。あの、Kikaijima <laughs> Mitsuoka is in charge of the island's post office. He also works as a guide. He's part of a system of volunteers who were born and bred on the island. They are glad to show visitors around. Uh, 
ここで4、5年前に皆勤職があったんですよ、はい、皆勤職が。それで、当該からいろんな観光客が来るだろうということで、あのこの、要するにガイド。はい、だから大掛かりなことだったら、まあ、いろいろあの業者もいるだろうしだからその地域に限定した観光案内をしようということで始まったのがきっかけですねちょっと今やぶになってるけどねおあ涼しい、うん、First, Mitsuoka takes an end to where the village's garden deity is enshrined A rope made from straw is wrapped around a large block of coral. あの、魚釣りに行くとかなんとかね、貝を拾いに行くとき、あの、そういうときに神様にね、お願いをして、から行きおったというはい。へえ。ここで孫が8、7人か。わあ。ああ、いたいたこれほらこれこれこれこれ
This banyan tree is one of the island's natural treasures. It's over a hundred years old. Banyan trees can withstand typhoons, so they also act as good windbreaks. And you can see how the roots, look at this, how they've integrated right into the coral, it's even going through it at this point. It's fascinating. There's no, there's no aversion to the coral, there's no aversion to it, but there's no special affinity for it either. And I think that relates to the people on this island too, just a, it's an acceptance of what you have and just a humble use of whatever happens to be around you. Yeah. <laughs> this tree's this tree's nice. Next, Ananda heads down to the waterfront. She wants to see the coral reefs close up. I think it's here. Somebody in it? Ah, sorry. Hello. 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 The coral on the seabed is sharp, and it's easy to cut yourself. So a wetsuit is advisable, even when you go out snorkeling. Hawaii. あの、川からのあの、ものが流れないので、いつも透明度がいいっていうのが一番の青い海っていうのが売りですね。魚たちも結構いますし、サンゴもありますので、はい、シュノーケリングには natural cove is a great place for looking at the coral. You just have to swim out 10 meters or so. There are many kinds of coral to discover here in a wide range of different colors. These corals offer a habitat for many sea animals. There are colorful butterfly fish, which like to hide in the shade of the reef. Lionfish look so elegant as they swim along, but be careful not to get too close. The marine ecosystem surrounding Kikaijima is rich with underwater life. You have to go a little bit farther out to see the real interesting coral shapes. Looks like brains and cabbage. Really cool. That was fun. I can see why Kikaijima is famous for snorkeling. So a lot of coral. It's really cool. A 
about a third of the total land area of the island is covered with sugar cane fields. The soil contains rich minerals from the coral. That's one reason why the sugar cane grows so well here. So here we have sugar cane just as far as the eye can see. And you can still feel the sea breeze coming in because the island is small, so you can just feel the breeze coming all the way across. Feels like it's gonna go all, take us all the way to the other side of the island. The sugar cane juice is used to make raw black sugar. The raw sugar finds another important use on Kikaijima. One of the most popular products is Kokuto Shochu, liquor made from black sugar. Ananda visits a company that's been making the liquor for a hundred years. Ah, <laughs> it smells delicious. Wow. Oh. The raw sugar is fermented and then distilled to a strength of about 30%. It tastes much like rum. Recently, Kokudo Shochu has begun to win fans abroad. It's often mixed with soda, but there are many other ways to drink it. It's strong. <laughs> and it's hot. This is a hot island in a hot factory. But it's actually quite refreshing. When I drink rum, it's like, oh, it burns a little bit, but this doesn't burn. There's no burn in this. I think it's just the right amount of alcohol. It's time for dinner. Ananda has come here in search of local specialties. Ah, come on. Ah, come on. Ah, come on. Ah, Koko Kikaijima Ryori. Naka, Kyomi Arimashte, Naka, Nani Garimaska. Ah, ah, Taksan Ariso, this net. Eh, oh, so good. Eh, Zembu, ano, Konoshima Kara, Totter in this. Ah, the heat. Tabate me tidis. A local herb that grows on the beach called Cho Meso is made into tempura. This herb is reputed to impart health and longevity. Taro yams are cultivated widely here. This has been a staple food on the island as rice does not grow easily. Green turban shells have a firm texture and are full of the flavor of the sea. Year round, there are many different foods to discover in Kikaijima. It's really good. <laughs> it tastes a little bit like Perilla leaf. It's a little bit bitter, but it's really mild flavor and so delicate. Mmm, <laughs> 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 Ah, 
、喜びの世界。もういろいろ分かってきた、今。なるほどね。だから、北海島でずっといると、みんな喜んで、幸せに暮らしてるんですよ。時間もゆっくり長います。私も喜ぼう。うん、<笑>長生きしますよ。Many of the islanders leave Kikaijima in search of work. Most dream of returning. Two that did come back have recently set up a fruit farm here. Kikaijima's subtropical climate is perfect for growing passion fruit and mangoes. Toshihito Kano runs this orchard with his wife Keiko. <laughs> Kano left the island after graduating from high school and went to work in Tokyo. But he returned five years ago. Keiko was another who left home but later returned. They met and married. Passion fruit right out of the, what do you call it, the rinds like this. Mm. And you just crunch the seeds. Eat it all. Mmm. <laughs> Ananda is heading for another village. She's looking forward to getting to know a bit more about life on this subtropical island. <sighs> She arrives at the guest house where she'll be staying. This house had been left empty for many years, but now it's been refurbished as lodgings for visitors. The facilities are very simple, but it only costs 4,000 yen per night to rent the whole house. Look at this old style Japanese bath. It's one of those deep tubs. I like those, I like those. Simple, basic. Yoshio Ito helps set up this guest house. As the population continues to age, the village has been losing its vibrancy. Ito and some friends decided to set up this guest house as a way to encourage more people to visit. Whenever a visitor arrives to stay here, the local people lay on a special event. Ah, community center, isn't it? 
どうもお疲れ様でーすああこんばんはああみんな集まってますねおおこんばんはあえあなるほどなるほどえおおもうみんなみんなワイワイ It's a welcome party うまわりけらじうまわりけらじえーはい。To reach Kikaijima from Tokyo, you can fly from Haneda Airport to Kagoshima or Amami. From there, you transfer onto a local airline. In all, it takes about five hours. <laughs> 